Have you ever wondered what games you should keep or you should lose? Find out here at Purdue's. Here's the expansion for Ugly Griffin and Local Dragons. You can see the rule book here. It's very simple how you're going to be moving these guys in. Maybe take you two, three minutes to read through this and you'll be up and running. It's very easy. You're going to pick one of the three dragons. Each one has a hard side and an easy side on it. So if you get Sleepy the Great, Sleepy collects two or more noise. She burns down the end and you lose. On the other side, it's three or more noise. Two or more smells or three or more smells and two or more fighting or three or more fighting. So what you're going to do at the beginning of the game is you're going to select one of these. Let's say noise. Anytime a patron would leave the bar and it has the noise on it, like so, you would slip it underneath here. And if it is able to collect three or more noise in this one, then you would completely lose the game. So a little bit more difficulty, and you need to be careful depending on which one of these guys you bring out, which icons that you're trying to get rid of. It's another wrinkle, makes things a little bit more difficult because you just can't get rid of the obvious card, maybe the best card to get rid of, because now we've got to take into consideration what the dragon is going to be after. Keeping in mind, you're only going to be using one dragon per game. In this case, you're using noise. You want to be careful about the noise that you're bringing down because you'll wake up Sleepy the Gray and he'll burn it all down. So you want to be very careful. This one's a little bit harder. adds a little bit wrinkle to the game. It's not my favorite expansion. I probably like more patrons better. This adds something in that maybe wasn't there. Artificially, feels kind of hard to me because these icons really didn't have that kind of meaning, and now they do. But it's a nice little wrinkle that if you want to add this in, you definitely can. This is not for the faint of heart. I feel like this one makes the game a lot harder. I definitely think you should play through this. Then you should play through the more patrons and kind of work your way up to this will be like the third difficulty if you ask me. I would add this one in last, if at all. I don't think I would seek this one out unless this just sounds really interesting to you. Just an extra wrinkle to the game. It's okay. Not my favorite. But if you're looking for that really, really, really hard version of this game, this is it.